In 1995, Toy Story came out from Pixar, and it was one of the first movies to be released from Pixar. And then in 2006, Cars 1 came out. This is just a Cars 2 Lightning McQueen with reference, but yeah. And if it wasn't for Toy Story, there most likely wouldn't be a Cars 2, or even Cars, I should say. But, um, here is Lightning McQueen. Now, like I said, in 1995, Toy Story came out, and the reason why Lightning McQueen's number is 95 is because it represents Toy Story, and that is just a cool Pixar Easter egg, and probably one of the biggest Easter eggs, because 95, if, if Toy Story came out in 94, Lightning McQueen's number would have been 94, if you get my point. But yeah, today we'll be taking a closer look at Buzz from the drive-in series. Now this will be the only one I'll be doing a video on is because he's the only one that came in the case twice. I got this from Get Me Collectibles, of course, for, as an entire case. And yeah, basically, at the end of the movie, there is this um, screening and the drive-in series is called, as you can see, driving up there. And there's three films, um, Toy Story, Monsters, Inc. and A Bug's Life. And the thing is, um, Toy Story was probably one of the coolest because Woody was like up to Buzz. I do have a Buzz here from China. You are a toy car. You have my penny for a bell. And he said something like that. I can't exactly remember what he says in the movie. But yeah, and then Pam comes along as John Latzenberger and he says, Birthday guests at three o'clock. And then all those classic lines reverted into the car's world. And especially if Toy Story is in cars, that just makes things even better. But yeah, anyways, let's start off this review of Buzz Lightyear. So let's turn on the flashlight here. And yeah, here is Buzz Lightyear, the name tag. We've got Ridge here. Of course, we've got the Vietnam version of Buzz, which is pretty cool, not Thailand. We've got Mattel, 3+. We've got some bunch of coding under there. We've got Buzz's artwork here too. Very nice. And on this side, we've got the drive-in and driving in a different language. At the top here we've got Lizzie, Luigi and Guido, which is pretty cool. Cars, no go up there as well. On the back we've got all the others from the other case. I'm not sure if you can see. We've got Flick, Mike, Sully, Ham, Petey Flea and Woody, which is pretty cool. And of course, as you can see here too, made in Vietnam, not China. And of course, the Cars logo there too. So yeah, let's start off with the unboxing of this. I got you. Here is Buzz Lightyear out of the package. Now, I don't think his helmet does actually come off this time, or I don't want to break it off, so I'm just going to leave it on for now. Yep, we can see at the front he's got these purple rims. As well, these purple tyres, which are pretty cool. Nice expression. We've got the swell underneath his chin there, which is cool. And on the top, we've got the buttons to talk to Star Command, I think it is, which is pretty cool. We've got the helmet, which we'll take a closer look at the helmet now, as I've got one which broke off a buzz, I believe, which is pretty cool. And here's the back wing of the helmet as well, with these stripes for the wings, which come out on the side of buzz, not at the back, but in Carl's world. That would make more sense. Of course, we've got these red stripes on the side too. On the side of Buzz now, we've got the Star Command logo here. Very really nice, as you can see. And on this side, we've got just a uh, we've got the laser one as well, which is the laser button where it goes. You press it, and it's beep, 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 which is cool. Nice wheels here, pretty small. And here is the base, which is. Try and get a good focus. Made in Vietnam. So that is pretty cool. Now, 
as I was going to say, I'm going to quickly compare it to the China Buzz. Of course, I cannot take the helmet off this one, and I'm going to. But as you can see, his colour is different. So, yeah. And also, the wheels are a bit different, but it might be not show up on camera. There's a knack. Oh, and it says Pixar on the back, too, which you might not be able to read. With these really cool headlights, but here it does say Pixar as you can see. So yeah. And this is the China version as you can tell by the white code and the China base. That does end my um review on Buzz Lightyear. I did have another package on here as you can see. But now I'm going on to my releases of Buzz Lightyear. As we can see here. Buzz and Woody, which is pretty cool. Of course, two pack from China. This was the last time they were released. Until they got released in the driving series, which I feel like it's pretty cool. I'm going to turn off the flashlight here. I do like Buzz and Woody, especially in this two pack. You can see where they're seen in the movie. There, you are a toy car. That scene, I love that scene. And of course, also from Toy Story, I don't actually have any package except for the one from the driving series, which I didn't get, which is Ham. The exact same for Woody here. I love his cowboy hat, it's pretty cool. But my favourite one from Cars and Toy Story is Todd the Pizza Planet Truck. We do have two variants of Todd. We've got the clean one from the Demolition Derby and then a dirty one from Cars 1, which makes completely no sense. But we could just pretend this we use this one in Cars 1 and then use this one in Cars 3, even though it's completely the other way around. Up next, we have my package collection of Todd. I've got the original Todd in the package from the Race Rama. And of course, we've got the second release from the OSN line in 2014. 2014 because the copyright is 2013. And then I also do have a package Todd from Cars 3. So, yeah, that does end my review on Buzz Lightyear here. Let me know in the comments below what your thoughts are on him. We'll bring back the whole Toy Story gang now. We'll put these two at the front because they are more important for this review. We've got Woody. Um, we've got Todd, which was the first movie he was ever seen in. Yep, so if you're new, please make sure to leave a like, dislike if you dislike. My next video will be on the variants of Frosty, suggested to me by Astro Smokey. So yeah, if you make sure to hit that bell notification button down below. Until the next one, bye guys. I forgot to show the Mini too.